Happy Vlogmas, everybody. Right now, we are about to head into the grocery store. My hair is soaking wet and I'm freezing. It's right about freezing right now. And we're going in to get some groceries for the next couple days, as well as like some holiday snacks and beverages. And I'm here at the grocery store because it is December 1st, which means you'll be getting this on December 2nd, which means I still haven't done anything with our elf. Elf on the Shelf hit the stores and I had already like graduated high school, I think. So my first experience with the elf was when my cousin who lives in Florida stayed with us for the week before Christmas. And my sister and I took it upon ourselves to kind of make him do really creative things because it was just kind of fun for us to do, like stage the elf every single night. So we took turns. So typically for the holiday season, my mom, my sister and I are all under one roof and we spend the whole month trading off days. So I have to stage the elf every third day. Because I'm at the lake house with Cap, we've decided that we're gonna do it, the two of us this year. And it was supposed to get done last night, but I didn't. He's never had an elf on the shelf ever, and he doesn't really know what to expect. So I'm here to just kind of get some supplies so that we're able to stage him for the next couple days. We don't really have any craft supplies, so I've been super limited as to what I can do with him. And I honestly just like don't have any ideas at all as to what to do. So we're going into Hannaford. We're gonna get some holiday bevies, some holiday snacks, as well as our groceries for the week, which is not as exciting. And we're gonna find something to do with this elf today. So let's go. I have returned from the store and I got some really good things. So let's start with yesterday. I went to Dollar General and I got some candy. I don't know why I went in there, but let's start with this. I got, and I put it in a grandma dish. This is literally one of those mixes of like grandma candy and they're already like doing that thing where they all stick together. I tried them on TikTok and 90% of them are really bad. Um, in particular, this little green one, if I can get it out, clove flavored, clove flavored. I gave it to Cap and Cap was like, that tastes like a clove cigar. Why would anyone ever do that? Um, so yeah, so that was not really a winner, but I also got these, which I just found. I forgot that I put them in the freezer last night and they're junior mints, but they're peppermint crunch. So let's try one of those. That's good for me. Junior mints, if they're not frozen, they honestly just taste like someone put a glob of toothpaste in my mouth, which I'm not really into. I'm new to liking mint with chocolate stuff. I've always hated it, but now I like it. These are the winners. They're called almond rocas. Um, essentially, they're like little toffees with almonds inside, dipped in chocolate and then rolled in some sort of almond, like crunch thing. And they remind me very much of like Ferrero Rocher, which is one of my favorite chocolates. Everyone always says that the Ferrero Rocher, it's like kitty litter. These literally look like little cat poops. Like when you unwrap them, it's ridiculous, but they're delicious. They're so good. Now let's get on with our little grocery haul. We went very festive with our grocery haul. So we'll start with this. Little gingerbread men. I wonder if they're gonna be good. Should I be sampling everything as we go? I'll sample. Ow. They're cute, very cute. Oh, how you doing, Soph? This is delicious, love that. I also got mini marshmallows because I think I have a little bit of a game plan for the elf today and I wanna get it done before Cap gets home. And then I also got these little mini candy canes because I need to finish advent calendars and I'm gonna put some candy canes as like filler in the advent calendars, I think. Thing with these, I had to get the dark chocolate mix because a lot of people in our family only like dark chocolate, so. And then I feel like I'm like being a traitor to nut pods because as you guys know on my TikTok, I talk about how I love nut pods creamer, but I tried this on my last road trip and I really love it. It's honest to goodness, Himalayan salted caramel. And I just really like this. To be honest, I've been putting non-dairy eggnog in my coffee every single morning and I've been loving that, but I think I'm kind of over it for a little bit and I need like just a couple days break of the nog, just a couple days break. So we're gonna move on to this. 
I found these chestnuts and I don't think I have ever had a chestnut before. And I saw them and at first I didn't know what it was. So I'm gonna, they have instructions to roast them on the back. When you go to New York City during Christmas time, they have like vendors that like give them to you in like that little like paper cone thing. Anyway, I've never had it before. We're gonna change that. I'm so excited about this. This is the Boom Chicka Pop white chocolate and peppermint kettle corn. And I just tried their other holiday one. I think it was holiday. It was, maybe it wasn't even holiday, but I really wanted to try this one. And I think, I think I'm gonna sample it right now. Wait, I really like that. White chocolate fa flavored peppermint kettle corn. Mm. This is really good. This is really, really good. I like this. I gotta put this on my story. Hell yeah. I'm having a lot of mint flavors in my mouth right now. Moving on, one of our activities this week is going to be doing a gingerbread house. And I cheated and I got the pre-made one because I the hardest part of a gingerbread house is making it stand up. The most fun part is decorating it. So I just wanna do the fun stuff. That's what the holiday season's all about. I'm not gonna make my life difficult if I don't have to. So I bought this one. Not only that, I got two, one for me and one for Cap. So we're gonna do them together this week. I'm really, really excited. So now I think we should go pose our elf. I think that's the next course of action. I don't know where I'm gonna put him, honestly. Okay, so here's the plan. My little sweet darling elf. I got this new grater that I've been using a lot to make my salads. So I had big marshmallows, so I went out and I bought little marshmallows and my plan is, He's going to be grating a big marshmallow to turn it into little marshmallows. Um, what is the plot? I don't know. There is no plot. Uh, maybe this is just how, like, why am I holding him like a baby? My maternal instincts are kicking in for this little tiny man. I don't really know what the plot line is going to be. Maybe this is how little marshmallows are made. When a mommy marshmallow loves the daddy marshmallow very much. Just kidding, that was lame. What cup should we use? We could use this cup. Um, so we'll go like this. I'm gonna check these to make sure they're not poisonous. Mm. I love marshmallows. I love marshmallows so much. We'll have a grater like this, right? And then maybe he's like holding on to it like this. Oh wait, this is good. No, or does he need to be holding the... Yeah, no, he needs to be holding the marshmallow. Okay. And now I'm cutting the marshmallow out because these were in the back of the cabinet and they've literally like disintegrated into each other. So that's fine. This is like pretty fucking gross if I'm being honest. Okay. So there's that. Super sticky. Okay, maybe I have to sit him in teacup like this. Yeah. Wait, this looks really cute. So cute. Let me throw out these marshmallows. Ta-da! That's how baby marshmallows are made, everybody. I think I kind of killed this low key. Like that looks really cute. I love him. Well, thanks for watching Vlogmas, everybody. Um, I love you and I will see you tomorrow. And I should probably start brainstorming about what I'm gonna have the elf do the day after tomorrow because this is, this is very stressful, but we pulled it off. Um, yeah, let me know if you have any elf on the shelf ideas. Okay, I love you, I'll see you tomorrow. Elf on the shelf, Kate, hit the store. Elf on the shelf, hit the sh Elf, elf on the sh Elf on the shelf. Elf on the shelf. Elf on the shelf.